What's up guys? Okay, we are here with a new bathing suit that I'm actually going to wear on my next photo shoot, which I might do a behind the scenes with that, um, but that will come out way later. And I am getting back in the hot tub because the weather is warming up, my backyard is done and looks beautiful, and I uh, asked Instagram uh, for some topics, and I figured this one was one that maybe ear up the children, um, and let's talk about some adult stuff. So, I will see you in the hot tub. Let me do a little 360 real quick. All right, let's talk. Oh, it's a little dark. Oh well. All right, look at the beautiful background. Oh my God. Last time we were out here, it was a hot mess back there. So, I am very excited that my backyard is done. I cannot wait to start making memories with my kids. Can't wait for it to get super hot. Um, it's a little hot, there's a little breeze in the background, but hot tub's hot, can't turn on the bubbles because then you guys won't be able to hear me. But, we are here to talk about the connection between exercise and increased sex drive. That's why I said, earm up the children. Okay, so there are two, there's probably many more, but there are two factors that I'm going to talk about today. Uh, the psychological factor and the physiological factor. Um, so you have you getting healthier. And so this is why I talk about um, how important it is to get healthy for so many reasons beyond just wanting to look good, okay? I always say that that's actually the bonus, but it's about what all the other things that come before then, before you really notice significant changes. Because you're gonna notice changes, but the significant changes come in time. From the, almost the get, you will notice that you will sleep better at night. You will notice that you will be in a better mood more consistently. You will uh, have less crashing in the middle of the day due to blood sugar, um, blood sugar crashing or, or poor nutrition, or you'll notice that you're maybe even a little bit more flexible. Um, you'll notice that you sleep better, deal with stress better, um, more creative, um, and again, confidence. So that's where it comes to the whole sex drive. So, you know, if you are wanting to have a higher sex drive, if you are wanting to, yeah, let's, let's just leave it at that. Um, you then want to try to get in more exercise because once you start feeling more comfortable in your own skin, once you start feeling more confident, once you start seeing the changes in your body, there's something that comes along with that. And that is, you know, wanting a partner to see you, wanting to be physical with somebody. Okay, so you got that. Then you got the physiological uh, um, factor, um, where when you exercise, the flow of testosterone through the body increases, and that is associated with increasing sex drive, okay? Speaking of sexy, uh, I really do like this bathing suit. Uh, notice how I'm back in the house, also notice how my face has a different coat of paint on it um, because it is a different day. So, something happened with the camera. I all of a sudden had like a coughing attack. So, I shut it down for the day um, and now I'm picking up where I left off. But I decided to give you another bathing suit. So, we are going to do a 360 and then I'm gonna go back outside and finish off with we talked about increasing sex drive. Now we're gonna talk about sex life. Um, and then I'm gonna add in one little thing, totally separate, um, maybe, maybe. Cute. See, sometimes I like when they're really high because I don't really have a waist, but I kinda like, like this one. Ugh. Okay, I think the second part of the video is gonna be a little bit better than the first part. <laughs> okay, so, um, first off, I really love my makeup. Um, you guys, 
I don't know when this video is going to come out, so I might, you might find out in the future who this was, or you might already know. I don't know, but whatever. So, here's the thing. Not only does it increase sex drive, but then once you actually do follow through with going through with the act, um, it increases sex life. So, um, stamina, flexibility, um, endurance, muscular endurance, picture some of the positions that you might be in, uh, more open to creativity, I'm hoping, um, for you, men and women. Um, these are all the things that come with the healthier you are. Um, and then also, again, as I mentioned, like confidence. You'll feel more comfortable doing different things when you're feeling more comfortable in your own skin. So, um, I also, I'm hesitant as to whether I want to make this into a full-on video. Um, so I don't think I'm gonna talk to you guys about that. I think I'm gonna talk about it in the next video. What happened to the lighting? Okay, I have to do a little reset. Um, so you know what, I'm not. That was a little teaser. Um, I am gonna talk about something in the next video and it has to do with women, working out, weights. Um, I was, uh, I literally was having a conversation with somebody, um, one of my new clients, and she was asking what size weights because she's going to be working out from home, and it sparked up a whole, the whole subject of women using heavy weights. So keep an eye out for that video. Um, I know this one wasn't very long, but hopefully um, you enjoyed the wardrobe change and the second and the makeup and all that other stuff. So I've been trying, I was trying to figure out when I wanted to do the second half of it. And um, I was supposed to be doing a photo shoot today. Something cut came up. Um, and now I figured, you know what? Might as well maximize on this beautiful makeup job that I have done by Dre um, and uh, make a video into it. So um, I am going to see you guys in the next video. Please leave your comments. Let me know what you think. Did you like this video? Did you like this specific topic? Mm, do you want me to go into different style things? Um, and if so, what? Leave your comments. Let me know. Like Nobody else is going to read your comments or whatnot and figure out who you are. So leave me a comment. If you don't want to put your comment public and want to come find me on my social medias, go and look and find me on Instagram. Find me on... Instagram is probably the best place. Find me on TikTok too, but you can't send me messages there. And then send me a private message. Hey, I just watched your sex life video and I uh, wanted to give you an idea that I, I didn't want to put on publicly. So, and then give me the idea. I literally need the whole point of this is to give you guys what you want. So leave your comments below. Let me know what you thought of this. Uh, let me know what you want me to talk about next. Um, and then if there's anybody that is looking to get themselves healthier, change their life, all the information for my programs, the only thing that's not on there is the cost. So go to my website, read my story. Um, if you haven't already watched the documentary, or just go straight to the, the main page and scroll down, look through the different options. I have four options on there. Uh, weekly check-ins, daily check-ins, weekly check-ins with Zoom, daily check-ins with Zoom. I have clients all over the U.S. that I train. I even have two clients international right now. Um, and both of them are actually going to start on Zoom uh, very quick, uh, very soon. Um, so we... Um, Again, look through all the information and then there's a contact me tab. You can go ahead and click on that, fill in all your information and please fill your cell phone number in because then what I will do is text you. I usually respond via text as opposed to via um, email. Um, and then we'll set up some time to discuss more details and then of course the rate and then hopefully get you registered to allow me to be your coach so I can change your life. So I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Like it. Smash that like. Smash it. Hit it right now. Two seats.